and the music for us to enjoy. Glass is gone. Hello dear friends, hello dear technicians, now he is here. The new Bulldog 2 is out and today I want to briefly and nicely explain to you what makes it so special. Because he looks great, this is the obvious. But hey, here is not a millimeter random. Every detail of this form is carefully considered. Also every detail of the function. That's what I want to briefly address now. The processing is so highly precise. These are partly state-of-the-art production machines. If wire cut means something to you, then you know what this precision in the barrel is all about here. Materials were used, aircraft aluminum, stainless steel was used, silicone rubber, which is dimensionally stable at any temperature, was used, and everything was finely electroplated. For this purpose, we have feathers that have been calculated in such a way that the function works well, the function is unique and cannot be replicated. Once, because it is a tool, care has been taken to ensure that it is easily touchable and accessible for users to interact with. Hands must be able to touch it, and that the parts that are functional that must not be touched by the hands are inside. Here you can oil, so to speak. Here it cannot get dirty either. If you want to prevent adhesive threads with your glue guns, then you lay it down closed and nothing can get dirty. Thus, it is actually fully usable. Hands comprehend him, you grasp him in your hand, and you become instant collaborators. The shape he possesses is so well thought out that he is able to maintain his standing even after being described. Therefore, the balance weight is slightly extended down here. And spread, the widening is the base, brilliant base with rubber support, and at the same time, it is also a slip protection for the yard. Then we have a small extension at the front, good for the thumb rest. I can catch it, so to speak, and I will show you that during one-handed operation, I can catch it with my thumb in the front and work nicely with one hand. This is extremely, extremely important with lime adhesives or other weakly adhesive adhesives. Then he installed marvelous camps. Uh, the bearings, you are able to tilt it. It cannot scratch. It makes almost no noise. It runs smoothly like a cat. The relationship between the weights of aluminum is 100 grease and 1.1 Q in the back. I described it in the introductory video. It has a wonderful ratio, so you hardly feel the weight when accelerating. And it's also cat soft ball bearing. Here are world class bearings inside that are so wide. This part, the entire area, are roller bearings and thus provide a wonderful guidance that not only ensures smooth running but also provides protection against wear. It is difficult to tear it anymore. It is no longer easy to misalign the adhesive pads, so to speak, because you are always guided in a beautiful manner. He can pull like crazy. And indeed, the spring that is responsible for providing the damping in the system has been further optimized and fine-tuned to enhance its performance and efficiency. It is now a bit softer, but it pulls enormously. A little harder would pull less, a little softer become ineffective. That's why this spring has been tested to the optimum. These have been countless attempts. And this is currently the optimal spring in terms of weight ratio that we discover, which pulls extremely well. This leads to the fact that on certain occasions only one operation is required, whereas in other scenarios two or three would be necessary. And this also leads to the fact that especially with cold adhesives, which have weak adhesion, one sometimes has to strike back due to the optimal damping, so a good pull through. The range of the pulling effect. Some technicians have tiny little pulling hammers for delicate pulling tasks. And then again, huge brute ones for really big adhesive pads or for side parts that need to be pulled and stabilized. You can now locate all of this information in a single device where you only experience the soft pull with the spring pull mechanism. So I don't require a tiny one, but it should be softer than this. You can barely operate it almost down to zero. And with this brutal weight, which is also rare, one has so much power. It's crazy. Simultaneously, it offers incredible control through soft storage. I can operate it with one hand, and I can securely hold it with one hand on the roof. For example, I can move it from bottom to top, using it horizontally with cold adhesives and such, all while enjoying the convenience of one-handed operation. This is a tool. Your hands, your hands will absolutely adore the thing. The spring is soft. Nevertheless, I can still adjust it like with the Pole Dog 1 by turning the weight until it is completely hard. Currently, I have no other components for it. 
Who requires it? I am unaware of who might require a hard puller, but certain applications or technicians find it useful. Then you rotate it 10 times and it becomes difficult. And then he also strikes with considerable force here, but I can only recommend to leave him soft. And that's what has the most impact. And if I really need a hard pull, then this soft spring does not affect it. So it doesn't affect it. But the latest feature is not only that it pulls 300% better and also pulls softer and implements pulling results better. I am discussing cold glue once more. Not only is the new pull lock able to accomplish that, but it also functions as a double hammer now. I am capable of pulling and I am also capable of hitting. He is capable of hitting, so to speak, here on the inside. I am unable to pinch myself. The beat function is present. This particular part hits inside here, so I always had to place things on the back that I otherwise had to accomplish with a hammer and a chisel in order to complete them. Meet up. This is definitely not a problem for most technicians. However, at times when I focus on the tip in front, I miss the target. I am able to fully abandon that now because I simply push it together and am capable of driving sheets in any position, can easily compress overstretching. I can drive edges and I can also punch flanges out of sides without encountering significant difficulties in achieving a flush finish. Can still attach impact extensions here. In starter set, some impact extensions included also on 5th, 16th. The American norm consideration is also taken so that you have essays for everything to beat. And the essays will be remarkably innovative, each and every one of them, um, including those that are still to come in the future. This is not only for roof edges, for folds, but there are also chiseling and cutting tools that can be attached. They will probably come later, and you can be excited about that. Yes, uh, the starter set, if you want to buy it, the starter set consists of the Bulldog, of course, various impact attachments and extensions, ball attachment, the manual card and everything. I hope you have plenty of success. Mm -hmm.